Hey guys, good morning. It is about 11:22, and as I'm sitting here on the at the office on this Friday, uh, I can't help but contemplate and just wonder. First of all, how did you wake up this morning? Did you wake up in a bad mood? Did you wake up as if as if you brought yesterday's problems to the day? Did you wake up frustrated? And if you did, you you have to learn how to let it go the night before because if you fall asleep frustrated. We are not promised tomorrow. We're not promised the next breath. So we're not even promised to see tomorrow. And so when you wake up, instead of being frustrated or mad or, or, or upset, still let it go because it's a blessing you're awake. Uh, as I sit here, I can only thank God for where I find myself today. Am I completely set where I wanted to be? Is everything great, perfect? definitely not I, there's so much more room for improvement and if there's not room for improvement in your life correct yourself and find room for improvement because each and every day is a day for growth um, but just more so the fact that we have to be thankful for what we have yes our problems aren't aren't uh, or better yet our situations aren't better than somebody else's but we need to be happy with where we're at we need to be happy with what we have and if it's not much that's okay it's I guarantee you there's a lot of other people don't have what you have you got to keep moving forward you know in my situation <laughs> it boy has this road been tough to travel but I wouldn't change it for the world I'm thankful for these experiences I'm thankful for these moments because of these moments it led me into different directions into spread my wings into areas that I didn't think I'd ever spread my wings into. You've got to have an open mind to tomorrow. you got to have that open mind for the next day. And if you have a closed mind, you think you know it all, then that just shows how dumb you really are. You can't be the upper hand in every situation. You have to have room to absorb knowledge. and You have to have room to absorb that, that newness, if that makes any sense. So, I mean... I don't know exactly where this video is leading me. I was just sitting here thinking, I'm like, wow, we need to be open to tomorrow. We need to be open to the next moment. And if we, you know, we feel like we, we have to, you know, just seal off that doorway because we know everything or we have a, a, a me too answer or I know answer, then that just shows how ignorant you are. And I hate to be disrespectful this way. Because I found myself having to get out of that scenario where, you know, you feel like, oh, yeah, I know everything. <laughs> Boy, don't you. I mean, I can't say anything that I haven't dealt with myself. So, you know what? Today, open your mind. Absorb and absorb and absorb. Do not be uh, too full to absorb more, if that makes any sense. Have a blessed Friday. <clears throat> Have a blessed Friday. Enjoy your day. Smile. At every moment of the day, even if you're you're feeling the fire right now, if you feel like you're in the flames, in that moment, in that time, victory is taking place. You're shedding out some of the, the onion pills. You're getting to the root of the problem. Be willing to endure it because it's through that endurance, it's through that resilience that you will find your destiny. God bless you guys. Have a great day. Enjoy this day for every moment is a moment to expand your horizons. And, and, and seek more and get more. God bless you guys. Uh, right below, I think there's a subscribe. Subscribe to this channel. We never know exactly what, what the Lord's going to bring down and what I share. And if, you know, maybe what I share reaches somebody out there and it helps them. It helps them get over things. But I'm thankful to be alive, to share some time with you, to hear the Word of God, and, you know, to lift everybody up in prayer. Have a blessed day, guys. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Have a great weekend.